Hello everyone. Hope everybody is doing good. And yesterday we had learned chapter one. So hope everybody understood that. Today we are going to learn a new chapter that is synonyms and antonyms. So synonyms means it is a different word but with the same meaning. Antonym means both are different, like different words and different meaning. So first we are going to in first form letter we are going to see choose the correct synonym for the given word. So the first word is abstract. So abstract means it is not a practical thing. So Options are option A material, option B theoretical, option C real and option D objective. So here the correct option is option B theoretical. So theoretical means it is not a practical. And the second question is fragile. Fragile means doing something necessary. So option A thrifty, option B lavish, option C wasteful and option D careless. So the correct option is thrifty. Thrifty means doing necessary things. So third one is amiable. Amiable means it is friendly. So option A mean, option B sad, option C friendly and option D alone. Here is the direct meaning that is friendly. So option C is the correct answer. So next one blossom. So blossom means in flower it is having a different meaning and here it is uh, referred to successful. So option A bloom, option B fade, option C strength, option D prosper. Prosper means being successful. So the correct option is option D. And third one. Third one is cease. Cease means stop. Okay. So option A dear. Option B halt. Option C comments. Option D create. So the correct option is option B halt. So next one, sixth one we are. So sixth one kajol. Kajol it does. It does mean me. So very nice to somebody. So option A is cold. Option D flatter, option C boogie, and option D John. So the correct option is option D flatter. Flatter means being nice to somebody. So question number seven. Question number seven despise. Despise means hate. So option A, option A detest, option B adore, option C cherish, and option D like. So the correct option is detest. Detest means hate somebody. So option A is the correct option. So next question number 8 we are going. So question number 8 is deserter. Deserter means empty. So option A inhabited, option B busy and option C vacant and option D full. So the correct option is option C vacant. Vacant means empty. So next question number question number 9 we are going. So question number 9 is earnestly. Earnestly means it is sincere and so the correct option we are going to see the correct option. Option A ugly. Option B terribly, option C dreadfully, and option D sobly. Sobly means sincere. So next option D is the correct option. So next we are going to see about question number 10. So question number 10 is question number 10 is demure. Demure means being shy. So option A demit, option B daft default, option C strong, and option D dirty. So option A is the correct option because option A demit means being shy. So next question number 11. 11 is evident. So evident means strong. Sorry. So question number 11. Evident. Evident means correct or exact anything. So option A dubious, option B obvious, option C hidden and option D vague. So the correct option is option B obvious. Obvious means exact. So next Next question number 12. Question number 12. Extol means it is a price. So here option A extra and option B extreme. Option C price and option D first. Here is the direct answer. So option C price is the correct answer. So next we are going to see question number 13. Question number 13 is fears. So fears means fears means sorry fears means it is angry so option a dull option b meek and option c stormy and option d moderate so here the correct answer is option c stormy stormy means angry so next we are going to see question number 14 question number 14 cul culpable so culpable means responsible so option a blameless option b responsible option c immune option d innocent so here is the direct answer that is responsible. So option B responsible is the correct answer. So question number 15. Hearty. Hearty means hearty means arrogant. So option A arrogant, option B naughty, option C simple and option D humid. So here is the direct option that is arrogant. Option A is the correct answer. So next 
so next we are going to start antonyms so antonyms means opposite word opposite word with different meaning so question number 16 is assemble assemble means to gather in the same place so option a group option b disperse option c handle huddle option d rally so option b disperse means separate so the opposite word for assemble is disperse next it is so question number seven is 17 is alacrity alacrity means cheerful so option a alarm option b sadness option c happiness and option d humorous so here the correct opposite word is sadness sadness means being sad so next we are going to see stigmat question number eight is stigmat stigmat so stringent means being strict so option a forceful option b harsh option c flexible option d demanding so the correct option is flexible flexible means not being strict and so next question number 19 19 is decry so so question number 19 it is a decry so decry option decry means being disrespectable sorry 19 decry decry means showing disrespectable so option a blame option b chai option c price and option d abuse so price means honor so the correct option is option c price so next question number 20 so we are going to see question number 20 question number 20 means constant so constant means doing regularly something so option a fickle option b firm option c regular and option d stable so the correct option is option a fickle so fickle means not being constant so next evacuate so evacuate means to remove or leave so option a abandon option b expel option c permit and option d leave so the correct opposite word is option c permit option c permit means uh, to allow so next we are going to see question number 22 22 means ancient so ancient means charm so option a disgust option b charm option c gratify option d entice so the correct option is option a disgust so disgust means dislike or not uh, like so question number 23 23 feral so feral means so again we are going to see question number 23 question number 23 is feral so feral means it is wild option a brutal option b damned option c strong and option d wild so the correct option is damned because feral means wild and damned means soft next question number 24 question number 24 uh, gallop means it is fast so option a drought option b eat option c slow and option d hurry so the opposite word for fast is slow option c is the correct option so next we are going to see question number so question number 25 indolent indolent means lazy so option a brief option b short option c lazy and option d active so uh, lazy the opposite word for lazy is active so option d active is the correct answer so next question number 26 hurl hurl means to throw so option a fling option b hold option c throw and option d cast so the correct option is the opposite word is option b hold so next we are going to see novice novice means inexperienced or new so opposite word for uh, new is new or inexperienced is expert so option a expert is the correct answer so next question number 28 excel so excel means it means good so option a is shine option b top option c fail and option d surpass so the opposite word for good is fail option c fail is the correct word so next we are going to see question number 29 question number 29 perish so perish means to destroy so the opposite word for destroy is to construct to construct means the word is building so option a build is the correct answer so next we are going to see sharan sharan means being calm so being calm is the correct exact meaning for sharan so option e smooth option b tranquil option c sedate option d turbulent so what is the correct word for correct opposite word for uh, sharan is turbulent turbulent means being violent so next we are going to see achievers section achievers section from 30 questions we have done 
So from this, next phi is like a minor test. So choose the correct synonym for the given word. Correct synonyms means correct meaning. Okay, first the thirty-first question is expedition. So option A quest, option B delay, option C halt, and option D hindrance. So expedition means organize the journey. So organize the journey for a particular reason. So what is the correct meaning for uh, our, this expedition is option A quest. Quest means question number thirty-four. Augment. Augment means increasing in size. So option A boost, option B enhance. Option C compress and option D enlarge. So the correct option is compress. Compress means reducing its size. So augment means it is increasing the size and option C compress means reducing the size. And question number thirty-five is pension. So pension means liking. So what is the opposite word for like? Is dislike or hate? So here is the opposite word. Option D is the correct word. Hate. So hope. Hope everybody understood the following lessons. So shortly we will share the quiz link. So please do participate in that. Thank you.